Uh, Coach, if you could just talk about, you know, getting ready for the playoffs, what it's been like this week, getting ready to play Sienega for you guys. Um, it's been pretty good. Yeah. Uh, guys are pretty focused, you know, and uh, one of the things is not getting too high or too low. Right. You know, we want them to be motivated, but we don't want them to be so excited that they're wearing themselves down. So. Right. It, this, can you talk about coaching on the staff that has a lot of college playing background and some college coaching background? What, what's it been like working with these guys? That's been awesome. I mean, yeah. Coach Amy was my coach. Coach Quinn was, uh, he was a grad assistant, but he coached me up too. So right. it's really cool, you know, being a player and then now I'm coaching with the very guys that coached me there. Very experienced, you know. Uh, coach Louis is very knowledgeable of the sport. Uh -huh. um, it's great working with him. And I mean, he, he definitely runs the practices. Uh, like we did in college and um, you know and, and the other thing is they're definitely we've got some player coaches on the team which they really reach out to the player they really uh, care about them and things like that so it's been it's been a great experience now we were talking to you, you, your counselor here at Miranda now is but is coaching something too that you want to do down the line is that why you're doing this or is it just something to help out or what's what's your plans with that um, well it's funny because uh, I, I really fell into coaching mm -hmm. uh, uh, a fellow coach, he was at my church, and he invited me in, and he's like, hey, you want to come coach? And I was like, well, I have some free time. So uh, I came over, and I started coaching, fell in love with it, and uh, started coaching the freshmen. I got to coach the JV. I got to work with the varsity a lot during the summer. And and, uh, and it was, you know, I played college uh, college ball for five years, um, so I definitely was knowledgeable of the sport. I loved the game, and I definitely paid attention when, you know, I had great coaches who taught me a lot. So. Um, that was really cool because I got to really uh, pour into these kids the same things that I've learned. And also being a native of, from Tucson, Arizona, going to CDO, mm -hmm. I thought it was a great way to give back because um, I had a lot of great mentors in my life. Uh, Coach Peace and, and mm -hmm. his staff when I was at CDO really uh, did a lot to help me become a better man. So mm -hmm. it's really cool getting to do the same thing with the same community I grew up with, helping them to not only just become better football players, but for me, uh, grow in, in strong character and better values that will help them to be great men mm -hmm. and successful men. And it, it's like you said, it's got to be a rewarding experience when you see the, the guys out there playing and following what you have them doing. And so, what, is that what you get out of it? Just like the interaction and being able to see them grow under your under your watch, so to speak. Absolutely. Uh, you know, especially like I said, I've gotten to work with varsity and mm -hmm. JV and freshmen, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, kids. If you really believe in them and you really take time, you know they really grow a lot, and that's I've seen that a lot with a lot of our players who I just spent a lot of time with them and just you know really encouraged them and really spent time trying to build them up and seeing helping them see the potential of what they could be, and a lot of them have really stepped up. A lot of them made varsity, which you know coming in they didn't think they were even going to be able to play, and um, you know with injuries you never know who is going to step up. You know also. Even with our team, I mean, this summer, um, those kids, that we, we talked about being disciplined. We talked about, you know, controlling our emotions, being self-control. Um, and I think, you know, from the beginning of this year and that summer, I mean, they, they had some struggles uh, during the summer of trying to, you know, teach them that. But, you know, we've been pretty good at not getting too many uh, penalties and things mm -hmm. like that. So that's definitely been, uh, you know, a great experience watching them grow as men and character and having better self-control on the field and things like that. Great. That's really good. I appreciate the time and best of luck to you on Friday. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks, Thank you.